It's been nearly a week now since the disappearance of a three-year-old boy from Two Rivers. Today, his mother and a man who lived in their home made a second court appearance. Our Abril Preciado was at the hearing. And Abril, what have you learned today? Now, in the last seven days, it's been heavy on people's minds out here to find Elijah Vu, and that is something that family and friends are searching for, as well as answers. And today, we actually learned new information from prosecutors. It's a week later, and we still have not had any answers of where this little boy is at. It's a sentiment that is felt throughout Manitowoc County. It's been almost a week since three-year-old Elijah Vu went missing. I've trekked through two rivers in Manitowoc. I've been here for 17 years, and I've explored places that I never even knew existed before. I said, oh, this is here, but it's worth it. It's worth every step that we take. Today, Katrina Bauer, the mother of Elijah, and Jesse Vang, the man that lived in their home, appeared in court where they were formally charged. As of now, Bauer is charged with one count of neglecting a child and two counts of resisting or obstructing an officer. Vang was charged with one count of neglecting a child. Prosecutors say Vang told investigators he was babysitting the boy but fell asleep last Tuesday morning. He says that when he woke up the boy was missing and he called 911 around 11 a.m. Bauer told investigators that she had left the boy in Vang's care for about a week. Both Bauer and Vang say the boy was left in Vang's care as a punishment for quote bad behavior. The courtroom was filled with members of Elijah's family and friends, many of which showed their support by wearing shirts with Elijah's picture. The answer lies with, with who's in, sitting in the county jail right now. I mean, a, a three-year-old little boy just doesn't walk off. And now we did reach out to police um, for an update on on Elijah and they do tell us that efforts are still taking place to find him. And um, we are also being told that Manit Manitowoc County Crime Stoppers is offering a thousand dollar reward for any leads that can help find Elijah. Reporting live in Manit Manitowoc County, Abdi Preciado, Fox 6 News.